hello everyone welcome back to my channel today in this tutorial i'm going to show how to crochet this beautiful and easy earrings so keep watching for the pattern i will be using embroidery thread three strands 0.5 mm crochet hook earring stud stopper jump ring scissor plier and glue so these are the things required for the tutorial i'm using a larger size yarn and hook we're going to start the pattern with a slip knot. Chain 8. So we have completed 8 chain. We're going to skip the first chain and make one single crochet each in the next 6 chain. And this is the last one. So we have completed six single crochet. Last chain is left. We are going to make five single crochet in the last chain. So I have completed 5 chain. Now we are going to work on the other side. Make 1 single crochet each in the next 4 stitches. And this is the last one. We have completed 4 single crochet stitches and the last 2 stitches, we are going to skip the last 2 stitches. So this is our first row, is done. For the next row, we are going to chain 1, turn our work. We are going to work 1 single crochet each in the next 5 stitches. And this is the last stitch. We have completed 5 single crochet stitches. Now we are going to make 2 single crochet each in the next 3 stitches. 2 single crochet in the next stitch. Two single crochet in the next stitch. Two single crochet in the next stitch. And now we are going to make one single crochet each in the next seven stitches.
So we have completed all seven single crochet stitches. So our second row is completed. For the next row, we are going to chain three. We are going to turn our work, skip the first chain, make one single crochet in the next chain. One single crochet in the next chain. In this row, we are not going to make any increases. In the center, we are going to make one single crochet each in the next 16 stitches. So we have completed all 16 single crochet. So for this row, we have 18 single crochet stitches. We are going to skip the last two stitches. And our third row is done. For the next row, we are going to chain one, turn our work. Make one single crochet each in the next four stitches. We have completed 4 single crochet stitches and now we are going to make 2 single crochet each in the next 3 stitches. We have completed two single crochet in the next three stitches and now we are going to make one single crochet each in the next 11 stitches right till the end. So I've completed all my single crochet stitches, so our fourth row is completed. For the next row, we are going to chain 3. We are going to skip the first chain, make one single crochet each in the next two chain. And now we are going to make one single crochet each in the next 12 stitches.
we have completed all 12 single crochet stitches now we are going to make a slip stitch in the next stitch so now we are going to fasten off the thread and weave the ends so here we will have a total of 14 single crochet stitches so a beautiful pattern is completed and this is for my earrings i'm going to attach earring stud with the help of jump ring to complete the earrings you can even use earring hook as well So a beautiful earring is completed. I hope you'll like it. Thank you so much for watching.